uh, uh, very good, uh, very good stuff for your uh, managerial uh, uh, situation. I wouldn't say I'm a manager. That's managerial situation, as in the step, you've stepped in and, and, and filled the brief. You, you just said on the TV about the defensive situation. It's down to you. Yep. It's kind of a re repetition and something that you, as a player, would never have accepted, surely. Um, what, I don't really understand. It's a repetition. I'm not really sure where you're coming from, but well, yeah. We listen. They were set pieces, and uh, you know we've we, we're improving them, or we're trying. So um, listen, we've won the game. It's a great result for us. Uh, we made it tough. They they were actually, I thought, very good. I thought their organisation was excellent, and they made it tough for us. Um, and I think we improved second half with the ball, but it was, we looked a little bit nervous, I have to say, at times. But overall, listen, we're delighted. Steve, was there a hangover from the Chelsea game? You very nervous time. Uh, I think so. I think, um, you know, it's uh, it probably knocked our confidence a little bit, getting beat. Um, when we felt we perhaps didn't, even though we didn't play so great, you know, we, we still think we, we, we should have got something from the game. But... Uh, maybe a little bit of a carryover. We're hoping that um, you know now we've won, um, that's gone, done and dusted, and we we get back on track. Yeah. And having lost your first London derby this season, how important is it that you bounce back against West Ham? Or well, of course, um, but you know that's the next game tonight. Well, listen, let's talk about tonight. I think for the minute, and we've done we've done great tonight without being fantastic, but we've um, you know we've got back on track. Um, hoping a little bit more confidence for the weekend, and that will be a tough game. Was the case of, uh, of the result more than the performance tonight? Uh, it always is, isn't it? <laughs> I think it's a results industry, and um, you know we, we, we got a result with it and we ground it out. To be fair, I don't think they had too many chances. Um, you know, we limited it, uh, them. Uh, to the, a, a few chances, um, we could have perhaps scored a, a few more. So, without being fantastic, we've had a great result. Would you put down the drop in your defensive performance to after being a Well, it was always going to be that way. There was only one way to go. On it, uh, you know, it's uh, three clean sheets. And listen, we've still got, we've done okay. We, you know, we haven't had an awful lot of goals against. Um, the goals that have been against in, in the main have been set pieces, which um, we're all disappointed with, and I think we can improve on. So um, things are looking okay. Steve, on a positive note, Aaron Ramsey's finish is a touch of the line of Messi. Right? It was a great finish, yes. Um, I mean, he's a good player. He's a good player this season, isn't he? There's something different that he's spotted there. He does seem um, like a big weight on his shoulders. I don't know if he ever had a weight on his shoulders, did he? Uh, well, yes, of course. I mean, it's you know, it was a horrific injury, and um, he's looking confident. But whether he's more confident than last year, I'm not. I'm not over sure. But he's a good player. How did you assess Jovino's performance and how he's adapting? Well, number one, he's scoring goals, so uh, I mean, his confidence is sky high. And number two, I think his link play is gradually improving. Um, I think he's set Santi up quite a few times over the last few games. Um, and he's learning that you know he's trade there. It's I don't think he's played there an awful lot. So, uh, and he's a danger with his pace and movement. At times, he's um, you know he, he he could be a top player. Adolski, he didn't have a lot of chances, but when he got one, he buried it. Well, yeah, he's uh, I have said before, he's a, he's a fantastic finisher. Um, he really is deadly, and uh, long may that continue. Yes, he was ill this morning. A um, bit of a virus, I believe. So that's where he's at. We're hoping he's fit for the weekend. Uh, the the group, something going round because Cochrane was out at the weekend. With, uh, well, I don't know if it's the. the I, I believe I'm, I'm told it's a, it's a different virus each time. So I don't know if it's in house or I, I, I've got no idea. But you know, I think we've had about four of them ill over the period of about two weeks. Mm -hmm.